we're showing our first printer, the Time One. We're excited to showcase it in public for the first time. We had our Kickstarter campaign from May to June of last year. We started shipping our shipments toward the later end of last year, so it's exciting to show the public. We have a lot of distributors, clients, and also potential partners um, seeing our prints in first time as well. So our printer is actually a very versatile printer. We can print from resolutions of very fine details, such as 37 microns, all the way until 100 microns. So these are some of the uh, low, higher resolution prints that we have. If you can see the fine details of the jewelry, you can actually see the logo, some of the prints on it as well. Um, this is actually one of the uh, prints that we're very proud about with using our castable resin. So after we print with really fine details, you can use a process called lost wax casting to actually form uh, molds like this. In terms of large prints, we can actually print up to 10 inches tall, which is the highest in the market today. Uh, this is a really fine vase from one of our partners, uh, Pin Shape. And uh, I, this is one of my personal favorites. You can see all the intricate design here. It's been really fun through Kickstarter and also uh, selling to our first clients as well in terms of what they print. Um, Drawries is one thing that we, we kind of knew from a long time, but there's a lot of surprises as well, such as really fine miniatures. Some of our clients uh, print tabletop games. Um, there's definitely mechanical parts as well. We have an ABS-like resin for functional prints. Um, universities actually have been purchasing our printer too. To have one printer, to have 200 students be able to print based on their application, so small prints and large prints. Uh, we've seen some pretty cool large sculptures as well, architectural designs, so it's been great. We built our first printer to be, to, to our point, you know, versatile, right? So it kind of fits the function of everybody. Um, but generally speaking, our bread and butter is actually focused in high resolution. So jewelry, you know, really fine sculptures, I think that's where we're, our focus is at. We just kind of started delivering our first batch of printers. We're definitely focused in terms of providing more material to our users. Um, our patented resin container is kind of our secret sauce to print two to three times faster and two to three times higher resolution than some of the other stylography printers out there. So we're focused on perfecting that as well, making it the lifetime longer for our current users. And using that same technology potentially for a few other products in, uh, down the line, so. In terms of what uh, folks will be using our printer for. Um, functional items, I think it was a little overhyped at the consumer level to be able to print actually things they can use. But I think with a printer like ours, being able to print at finer detail, um, you know, prototypes, um, even mechanical parts is actually possible because you'll print more precise uh, parts that can replace certain things if you lose, um, you know, certain automotive stuff and whatnot instead of, sometimes you can't even order it online anymore. So being able to 3D print it now, I think will solve a lot of problems.